My name is Kelly Lopez, and today I am graduating from Jefferson Medical College. My parents are Puerto Rican transplants who moved to the mainland United States, leaving behind hardships I would never have to know. They met as casino workers in Atlantic City, New Jersey, where they worked long, arduous days to provide what they could for my older sisters and me. But even with their hard work, odds were stacked against us. We maintained a household rich in love, but little extra. I was the first of my siblings to graduate from high school and the first in my extended family to attend college. When I started, medicine wasn't even an option. I simply didn't have the exposure or role models to lead me to believe that I could eventually become a physician. But as graduation approached, I decided to sit for the MCAT, and with that, I began my journey to Jefferson. Since then, this journey has been highlighted with amazing mentors, strong leadership, and an unwavering support that allowed me to thrive as a student doctor. Some of that support came in the form of a scholarship that made my pursuit of a Jefferson education possible. I have been the fortunate beneficiary of the Eric A. Everts Scholarship Fund, created by a Jefferson alumnus from the class of 1950. Dr. Everts himself attended Jefferson with scholarship support and wanted to give other students like me the same opportunity. This scholarship is not simply a negative number on my financial aid summary. It is a constant reminder of the people here who stand in my corner every day. The Jefferson experience showed me that there are other people in this world who believe in my potential to lead, to learn, and to heal. It has served to motivate me to become the best physician possible. I am honored to say that my Jefferson journey is not stopping at commencement. I am entering Jefferson's Family and Community Medicine Residency Program, and I hope to continue work I have been doing with Philadelphia's underserved youth and adolescent populations with the goal of creating a more favorable environment for them, one with positive mentors and one that instills feelings of pride, dignity, and hope. Today, thanks to Dr. Everts and my Jefferson education, I am a doctor. I am on my way.